It's heading back to GameStop. My pre-order on Tiffany came in. I'm going to see if it's a chase. And if it's not, I'll probably just see if they have Jack Torrance, Carrie or something. Damn, they want 20 bucks for this. It only cost me $7. I know we only pay 7 bucks at uh, Toys R Us. Oh, yeah, that was overlooking it. That's all Justice League. There's a gorilla. And that's probably the littlest six inch box I've ever seen in my life. I'd love to find a chase to this guy. Something left in bacon. Cute. Okay, guys, I don't see anything. Maybe. Maybe. No, I don't know. Um, Norman Bates. It looks like Wonder Woman. Don't see any Kelly. Well, they actually had the horror pops hidden behind a bunch of uh, Norman Bates. They were able to get Annabelle, they had Carrie, mom put it on hold because she wants it more than I do, and we're really low on money right now, until the first, but yeah, got my Annabelle, I did not get a Chase Tiffany with my pre-order, so I canceled that, and went ahead and put the money to pay towards this, but yeah guys, see y'all. Happy Sunday. My uncle called, said he's gonna give us some gas money if we come down to visit him to pick up a poodle. So we're on our way there. And since it's a new town, I'm gonna go around and see if I find anything. Even though I really ain't got too much money to buy anything. See y'all when I get there. Fort Smith, Arkansas, first stop, Toys R Us, to see if they have Scott Pilgrim with the guitar. Okay. Put them in the pants. Chris Lane. 
Boss Baby, My Little Pony. There's one of the Aries. Really. Man, I see this guy everywhere I go. There's another one. And another beaver. Voltron! Oh, I wish I had the money. Ed! And uh, that dude from Lord of the Rings. I will never find Stimpy. If anybody has the chase, please, please trade me. I haven't seen him in a long time. Johnny Cameron. Okay guys, I don't see tinkles or anything else. But the more you set, it will never be complete.
Guys, just got out of Toys R Us. They didn't have anything. I went through everything inside and out. No tinkles. No Scott Pilgrim. No fucking chases. No nothing. Did have some Aries, but the boxes were all messed up. Found one X23. Good shape, but then I looked at the box and I noticed that on the bottom. So I just said, screw it. Heading over to this hot topic I've never been to. See what they have. See y'all when I get there. Three more to go to Hot Topic. I think there might be a GameStop in here too. I'm not sure. It's definitely dark in here. It is a lot nicer than the mall I got back home. I will never Just got out of Hot Topic. They didn't have shit. I'm going to go visit my uncle for a little bit. And then I'll probably hit up Books A Million before heading back home. See y'all. Books A Million to see what they got. Just got out, didn't find shit today. Went ahead and went back to Toys R Us to pick this up since it was only six dollars and something. Here's a look at what it looks like. Oh, but yeah, not every hunt can be successful. I'm heading home, it is extremely hot out here. I'm heading back to Conway. See y'all when I get there. Hey guys, finally back home. As you see, I didn't really find anything there. But that's okay. I did, however, dig through everything at Toys R Us, but they didn't have any chase. No tinkles, had some areas. But, that's okay. Go ahead and remember Hot Topic, they didn't have anything. I asked the woman if they had got any Pennywise in. Because I need to, I'm looking for the chase, but I'm also looking for an extra common for my brother. And well, the woman was a bitch. I'm just gonna fucking put it out just like that. The woman at that hot topic was a bitch. She's like, Do you see anything on the shelf? I was like, No, but maybe tell me if y'all sold one. She's like, Well, if you don't see it on the shelf, well, then, like, I have ADHD so I usually get mad when somebody says something to me you I had to control my anger and I'm glad I did because it's all about when you're hunting no matter if the people working at the place you're hunting as an asshole or a bitch or anything you just smile say thank you very much and walk away because that way you feel good about yourself knowing that you didn't argue. And that's what I did. I just smiled and walked away. But man, honestly, now that I'm home, I'm just going to be honest. She pissed me off really bad. I mean, all I asked was a simple question. And the, all I asked was a simple question. 
And the woman's like, do you see anything on the show? I was like, I don't know. I can't really see at the very top. Uh, that's okay. Who cares? Who cares? I know eventually I'll find another common and possibly the chase for myself. But, I'll go ahead and show y'all everything I did pick up. Now, I did go ahead and, uh, as you probably saw in the video, I did... Go ahead and film a little bit in Books A Million. And I know I'm not supposed to because my Books A Million here, where I'm at, that's a big no-no. But when I walked into Books A Million, I saw some guy with his camera out filming. And I thought, well, they're not saying anything to him. So, you know what? I'm just going to get my camera out and just scroll through the pops just for a quick second. They didn't say nothing to that guy, so I just figured, eh, I'm just going to do it. But, yeah, guys, let me go ahead and show y'all everything I picked up. Now, yesterday, as you saw, I ran by GameStop. Friday, they called me and said, oh, your Tiffany's in. Would you like to come pick it up? Like, I will be there tomorrow to see what it looks like. It wasn't a chase, and the paint was really bad on the regular one. So, I went ahead and took the $5 off her, canceled it, put it towards Annabelle. Because I really wanted this when I saw the design, and this looks great. I love how I have one eye is cracked, and it's blue. I'm not going to show y'all too much of this. I'll be making a video by herself later. But yeah, this is pretty much Annabelle. They had Carrie and Norman Bates, but um, I'm going to... And I put them on hold till Tuesday, and I'm going to try to, I'm saving my money to try to go back and get them too. Well, this books a million will get them in, they'll be cheaper on me. When you, because I'm low on money right now. But yeah, guys. Okay, guys, so yesterday, that, that's what I got. Now today, as you saw, I did go ahead and pick up one thing. And it's the Toys R Us exclusive Civil War t-shirt, pop t-shirt. The only reason I picked this up because it was on clearance for $6.98. So I went ahead and picked it up. The hell. It's cool looking. And I ain't got too many pop t-shirts. And I can't keep wearing the same pop t-shirt over and over again for you guys. So six bucks and six ninety-eight might as well. But yeah, let me actually go take this out of the box and I'll be right back. Okay guys, here it is. Looks great. I love the design in this. I hope it fits because this was the only one I could find that looked like it might fit me. You know what, guys? Let me go ahead and try this on. Thank you, guys. Well, it's a little tight in this area on the shoulders, but for $6, I can make it work. Maybe if I lay off Taco Hill. Maybe I'll be able to fit it better. But yeah, guys, that's everything I got. Mm -hmm. The Annabelle Pop and this awesome Captain America Civil War t-shirt. See y'all next time. Till the next video. Bye. Guys, thanks for watching. Please comment, like, and subscribe down below. Along with checking me out on all my social media networks to the left. Thanks for watching. Till the next one. Bye.